Well, howdy everybody and welcome to our channel. Uh, if you love to hunt or you're thinking about hunting using thermal gear, uh, I decided we'd go ahead and do a, a little unboxing product review. This is the Axion XM30S. This is a monocular made by Pulsar. And I wanna show you about it and tell you about it. And also tell you that we've got another video that if you hit the link right here on this video, you're gonna see we're, uh, uh, we're actually giving away uh, action unit just like this so anyway uh, when you open this product up you're gonna have here's the unit right here I mean it's, it's pretty doggone sexy looking I mean if you ask me it's a small the uh, I mean it fits in your hand uh, let's see here what else we got in the box we've got uh, oh, these are all the accessories so we're gonna take this and we're gonna of course we've got the instruction manual right here we're gonna take this and lay it all out. I'll show you what it comes with. Battery charger for, got two ports for the battery. Got a little plug in for the wall. You're gonna have your little wire to connect this thing to the battery charger and also connect your monocular to download what's on it. And there's your battery right there. Now, um, okay, it, it's small. I mean, it's really small. I like that. Uh, I wound up about Three weeks ago, I wound up had one of these sent to me and I've been testing it out. But I want to point out that Pulsar is a sponsor of ours, uh, but they're not going to see this video until uh, y'all see it. Uh, I think that people need to, uh, I'm unfiltered. Okay, so if it's going to be good, bad, or ugly, I'm going to tell you the way it is. I'm going to break away from this and ask you a question. I want an honest answer. Okay, because my guys told me this and I was blown away. They looked at the analytics of our video and they said, that over half the people that watch our videos are not subscribers to our channel, I think. Then why are you watching? Seriously, all you gotta do is, man, pull the trigger. Pull the trigger and hit that subscribe button. Come on. Anyway, uh, this little unit sells for about 2,000 bucks, okay? And for 2,000 bucks, I, I believe it's a pretty good value. Uh, as a matter of fact, it's an exceptional value when you take a look at all the other thermal handheld units on the market. But the battery, it slides in just like this, and to get it out, there's a little button right here on the front. You just mash this little button right here, and the battery comes out. The battery life is about five hours, okay? Uh, to charge the battery, you take this little charger right here, and plug it in, just like that. Of course, you hook your wire from here to here, and you plug it in the wall, and it's got a series of lights. You'll see those lights on it right there. Those lights will wind up uh, staying all green when it's fully charged. Of course, uh, you've got to uh, make sure read the instruction manual. The instruction manual is going to be very, very helpful. Okay, as far as uh, batteries, uh, you can buy these extra batteries. They're less than a hundred bucks. You can just go online on the Pulsar website and buy these extra batteries. So anyway, you can, uh, for five hours, the, the cool thing about it is five hours, you can go do a heck of a lot of hunting. Uh, as far as the product review goes, you know, I could get into a lot of specifics as far as the, uh, the electronics go, but I'm a hunter. I want to talk to you about what I really like as far as hunting goes. So as a hunter, I find thermal being so incredibly effective because, uh, especially hunting hogs. Uh, hogs are nuisance animals. They destroy property. They and and they just they're they're smart. They're a lot smarter than people give them credit for. But when you take thermal gear out to the field at night, you're not going to believe how many there are. You can take a look during the day and think there's no hogs here, but at nighttime. Those animals light up like Christmas ornaments. They're so easy to see. It's for that reason I've been so effective using this gear for many, many years. And why I'm excited about picking up this little monocular because this is so small, I'm actually able to take it out and uh, put it in shirt pocket if I want to. And you know, where with the uh, big brother of this, or the, uh, the XP50, I cannot do that. So uh, image quality compared to the XP50, I think the XP50 does have a better image quality but I'll let you be the judge of that. By looking at these two images side by side, you can actually tell the quality of each. If you take a look at this little strap right here, okay, it can be held with the right hand or you can take the strap off and you can put it on the left hand, okay? Uh, the, again, the reason why I really like this unit, and I've been using the, uh, the Pulsar monocular, the XP50, and it's a much bigger unit than this. And the, the issue that I have with that is it's so big that many times when I'm using it to scan and I wind up getting into it, what I'm gonna call an engagement, what I do with that XP50, well, a lot of times I may have to set it on the ground because my pockets aren't big enough, but you don't have to with this one right here. The Axion is small enough, it'll fit into any pocket. But take a look at this lens cap. 
lens cap goes right there and it's magnetized right here on the little strap so the lens cap you're never going to lose that lens cap another thing if you take a look right here on the very top of it there's a little light let me turn this on there's a little light that's going to go on the very top of the unit and although it's very hard to see in the daylight at nighttime it's pretty easy to see but it's dim enough and small enough that uh, the animals that you're hunting are not going to be able to see it i want to talk about when you saw me when i turned it on this the on off button is this blue button right here the on off button uh, i'm going to tell you all this i, I got online and I actually was looking at uh, some different guys reviewing this product and um, i don't i don't know where they're getting their information from but in the if you go online or you check the manual it says it takes three seconds for this to turn on some people say it turns on immediately and if it does that's good for you but i time this it takes exactly three seconds for this to power up so uh keep that in mind now uh you know i wish it had powered up faster than that but the and the reason why is because a lot of times i get in a situation i need to see something right now in three seconds the animal can be 50 yards away so it does take a little bit of time three seconds for this unit to turn on for me um, as far as uh, operation goes, uh, I want to talk to you about temperature. First off, the, the case, this is magnesium, okay? It's built out for stout. I mean, it's, a, it's nice, it's ergonomic, uh, it's shaped very nice, about the same size as a, as a laser rangefinder, so it fits just about anywhere. But the cool thing about this thermal unit, it operates way down in sub-freezing temperatures. In other words, all the way down to 13 degrees below zero Fahrenheit, and that's fantastic. Now, you got a little strap on the bottom of it. Right here, this strap unthreads where you've got a little uh, female threaded end right here. That way you can put it on a tripod if you want to. All right, so let's talk about image quality because that's really why you purchase it in the first place. Okay, image quality I think is superb, especially considering a $2,000 price range. So the reason why the image is so clear is because the number of pixels that this unit has, uh, they're small pixels. And that's going to create a finer, sharper image for you. I've used this on... Uh, I mean, I went out and I, I got some uh, hogs and cattle, um, uh, deer, ducks, squirrels. I mean, I, I've used this a lot, and I am blown away with the quality of the image. Of course, the uh, as far as magnification goes, it's uh, it's a four and a half power, but it it will uh, it will zoom out to 18 power, and you can do that just by going through the menu, the buttons right here on the top, uh, and the cool thing is the menu on this thing is really really simple I mean as far as it has seven different color palettes in other words seven different color combinations that you can kind of choose whatever you like personally I like uh, red hot and white hot okay but uh, you know that to each his own I mean I've got uh, I mean tons of footage doing other videos uh, using the pulsar gear and most of the stuff that we do is either going to be white hot or red hot so that's just my personal favorite. If you wear glasses, it's important to point out that you're gonna need to fold this eyepiece, this eye cup down here like this for the uh, for you to be able to see through there properly. Now I wanna talk about uh, one of the coolest things about this is it connects via Wi-Fi to your cell phone. You're gonna have to have the uh, Stream Vision app, but it is slick, man, and you can watch everything that's going on right on your cell phone. And one of the big things about this is warranty. Okay, let's talk about warranty. I mean, I've dealt with the people over at Pulsar for a long, long time. They've got a great warranty. It's three years, okay, from any manufacturer defect. And uh, they've got a, a service department that handles everything if you do have an issue. But so far, this unit right here, I'm going to give it uh, on a scale of uh, 1 to 10. I'm going to give this probably an 8.5. And the reason why I'm not going to give it a 10 is, first off, I don't believe there are very many 10s out there because technology just keeps coming out further and further down the road. But uh, an 8.5 because there is room for improvement. But dollar for dollar, for $2,000, this is one heck of a unit. So uh, if you're thinking about buying a handheld thermal monocular, I encourage you to check this one out. Uh, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, I'd like to ask you to uh, subscribe to the channel. If you've got any questions, go ahead and post them below. All right, so we do have a giveaway of this product going on on our channel, so make sure and check out the link uh, that's in the description of this video. Make sure and register for it. My name is Keith Warren, and thanks for watching. This stuff right here is $2,000 worth of product, and one person watching this video is going to win it. That's right. It's free. Okay? $2,000 worth of gear. But in order to be eligible to win, you have to do three things. You have to like the video, you have to also make a comment, and you have to subscribe to our channel.